Electronic stability and traction control systems are advanced technology systems that help drivers maintain control of their vehicles, particularly in challenging driving conditions. They are typically standard on new cars and their sophisticated sensors and computer controlled technology work together to help prevent skids, slides and other potential accidents. The main goal of the Electronic Stability Control or ESC is to minimize skids and help the driver maintain control of the vehicle. The system uses sensors to detect when a vehicle begins to lose traction or when the direction of travel doesn't align with the driver's steering input. It then applies corrective actions such as reducing engine power or individually braking the wheels to help the driver regain control. Understanding the role of ESC in safe driving is crucial. It does not only prevent accidents, but it can also save lives. The National Highway Traffic Safety Administration estimates that ESC could prevent up to a third of all fatal crashes and reduce the risk of rollover by as much as 80% for SUVs. Now let's shift gears and talk about Traction Control Systems, or TCS. They are designed to prevent wheel spin during acceleration. This is particularly useful when driving on slippery surfaces like ice or wet roads where maintaining traction is paramount. Just like electronic stability control, the traction control system uses sensors to monitor wheel speed. If the system detects that one or more wheels are spinning faster than the others, a sign of lost traction, it will take corrective actions. These may include reducing engine power or applying brakes to the affected wheels, allowing the driver to regain control of the vehicle. Both electronic stability and traction control systems operate on similar principles using advanced technology to monitor and control a vehicle's performance. They use a series of sensors to monitor factors such as wheel speed, steering angle, and lateral acceleration. This data is then processed by a central electronic control unit, which decides if action needs to be taken. If the ECU detects a problem, it can take a variety of corrective actions. In the case of the electronic stability control, it might apply the brakes to one or more wheels to reduce engine power to help the driver regain control of the vehicle. Traction control, on the other hand, might limit engine power or apply the brakes if it detects wheel spin. Electronic stability control and traction control systems are composed of several key components. These include wheel speed sensors, steering angle sensors, a yaw sensor, and an ECU. The wheel speed sensors monitor the rotational speed of each wheel, while the steering angle sensor detects the direction in which the driver is intending to go. The yaw sensor measures the vehicle's rotation around its vertical axis, essentially detecting whether the vehicle is turning more or less than the driver's intentions. All these components work together seamlessly, making thousands of calculations every second to help keep the vehicle under control. It's a testament to the marvels of modern engineering and technology. Thanks for being with us, and we'll see you next time.